everyone, it's Sergeant Tips at GoWearHipHop.com. Right next to me is uh, B96 Chicago's Julian. What up? How are you doing tonight? I'm good. I'm cold. It's a little windy here in the shy, but uh, I'm good, man. I'm. Uh, this is cool. This is cool. Yeah, so, I mean, we're here at the Portage Theater. Help me, help Haiti. That's right. Um, all the benefits here tonight are going to UNICEF. That's right. So, it's for a good, good cause. Um, Julian, how did you get involved with this? Uh, you know what it is? I, uh, the, the girl that... that, that that's doing this whole thing, that started the whole thing, uh, Jen DeLeon. I think, I, I, I don't know how I know her. I met her through a mutual friend and she hit me up on Facebook. And then it was just kind of like that. It was like an organic thing. And I mean, you know, I, I've always been the type of guy to, if I can do it, if I got the time, I'll participate in anything that that, uh, that supports a cause. You know what I mean? That, that whether it's cancer or it's for Haiti or, you know, it's for, 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 you know, for people that, that, that need help raising money. I'm always going to do it if I can. So, I mean, it's really no question for me to, you know, if I'm going to do this or not. It's absolutely, yes. Yeah, excellent. And, you know, shouts to Jen for putting this all together. Yeah. A lot of hip-hop, R&B, spoken word, dance tonight, so. Yeah, her dad is here, too. Oh, yeah? That's kind of strange. It's like a family affair. <laughs> not like that. Not like that, but you know what I mean. Yeah. You know, it's cool to see the whole family support. Exactly, yeah. exactly. I didn't mean that like in a perverted way. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, Julian, you know, the voice behind the radio here, um, you know, for aspiring DJs looking to make a name for themselves, what sort of advice can you give them? Uh, well, I mean, I think DJs, the play music, personalities, I'm a personality, I talk yeah. on the radio, it's kind of all the same. I mean, I think that you need to probably, uh, you know, start work, do whatever you can. For me, I started, you know, in Washington, D.C., I'm an East Coast guy. I started in D.C., started as an intern. I worked for free for a lot of years. A lot, a lot of people don't know, you know, like, you know, my first paying job is making $17,000 a year in a small town in Virginia. It's like Peoria here. You know, so for a DJ, I'm friends with a lot of DJs here in Chicago, and I, I've seen them, you know, I've seen a lot of them come up, I've seen a lot of them not. And, and a lot of it comes out of hustle. Hustle, marketing, um, you know, I know a lot of DJs that are really good that are going nowhere because they don't they don't do one or the other, they don't do both. I mean, then and then and then also the opposite, I see, you know, after being in the club so long and hearing so much, I can get an idea of what's good and what's bad. I hear a lot of DJs that are not so good, but, yeah. you know, I mean, yeah, equally I mean, they're pretty I mean, successful yeah. because, you know, they know someone, they know how to market. So, you know, you know, you know, you gotta, you gotta be on the street, you gotta, you know, you gotta hustle, whether it's online or... You know, on the street, you got to do it somehow. Right? Especially making your name online and everything. Yeah. So, is, yeah. is that how you? How did you exactly link up with B96 to, to get um, from DC to here? Yeah, that's a good question. I was in DC uh -huh. and I, I was doing really well there. I had a big name in DC on the radio. Okay. And uh, actually, you know what? That's what it is. They came to me. That's kind of out of the blue. Uh -huh. I think I think they just heard what I did, and I did. And then I I, I brought it to the evenings. I did nights here for four years. Yeah. I did a lot of wild yeah. shit. And, um, and, you know, I mean, that's what, I don't even know what to say. I mean, I hustle my ass off. I don't know no one here. I don't know no one here. You know, so. So. You know, I'm still getting new people every day. Yeah, yeah that's true. That's yeah. true. I mean, meeting new people and hearing new music. So, about the music. Yeah. Um, what sort of, like, characteristics about the, the mainstream sound today that you're, are you particularly enjoying? Oh, uh, we mainstream, you mean like you hear on the radio? Yeah, that you hear on B96, stuff that you play. Uh, well, you know, I mean, I'm not going to bullshit you. Like, B96 and... Kiss FM, all these stations, they play hit music, popular music, you know? I mean, I like it. Some might, some music I don't. But yeah, I mean, ultimately it, it's what's widely accepted. But you are starting to see music like Tyro Cruz or like a Jason Derulo who, and I, I'm not, look, I'm not, I'm not a musical, I'm not an expert, but I, you know, I, I, you know, I, he's definitely doing things uh, a little bit different than, you know, how it's done like a year, year and a half ago. Yeah. I don't even know how you would call it. Right. But you kind of get what I'm saying. Like, uh -huh. like the, the standard now, uh, it's becoming, in, you know, my analogy is like, it used to be like this, the scope is now a little bit wider, you know what I mean? So, you know, you know, like, uh, you might see artists like, um... I mean, artists from the UK are coming and making yeah. a splash here, like, they Well, like, uh, or, you know, or out of DC, like a Wale. Yeah. You know, you might, you might hear a Wale on mainstream radio sooner than you know, you yeah. know what I mean? I mean, that's not going to be on common anymore, uh -huh. because, I mean... You know, I don't want to get too serious, but I'm just saying, like, you know, you got iTunes, you got, you got uh, internet radio, you got all these like different forms of exposure to music. So, you know, it's really up to you guys. It's up to who's looking at your interview, exactly. the, the, the blog. Fans. Right, right, exactly. They want to, you know, you if you want to hear Wale, you're gonna. We don't make decisions. We make decisions based on your preferences. See what I'm saying? Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah, definitely, definitely. So, you know, these teeny boppers want to hear Justin Bieber. <laughs> you know, got to play Justin Bieber. You know yeah, what it is in demand. Yeah. So. Um, Cool, well, you know, for those out there listening, um, where can they, when can they listen to you on B96? Uh, 5.30, 10, 
Five thirty to ten every morning, Monday through Friday. Depends on the day. Depends what I did the night before. So sometimes six o'clock. <laughs> all right. That's when I roll in. <laughs> and uh, I'm not even bullshitting you there. Uh, and uh, you Facebook me, so, uh, Julian on the radio, JulianOnTheRadio.com, Twitter, Julian on the radio with the D A. So oh, yeah. that's it. That's switching it up. Right. Connect with me. That's yeah, right. definitely. Well, we appreciate the time. Thank uh, you, let's sir. go inside. Let's enjoy the.